Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another channel 256 News. Hope you guys are doing well after that holiday weekend, getting stuffed from those turkeys, getting some sleep, getting some rest. But now it's back to the grind. We're here to deliver. I'm your host, Trevor Bello, and I'm here to deliver the biggest stories currently happening in the Bitcoin space, all in under about 10 minutes, so that you can get back to doing exactly what you love the most, which is not listening to the news. This broadcast is brought to you by Bitcoin Mining World. We want you to join us in building the future of Bitcoin mining. When you choose us as your equipment distributor, you're not just buying mining equipment. You're investing in the future of Bitcoin mining. Every purchase supports our mission to educate, uplift, and empower miners worldwide. From hosting boot camps and creating training programs to building a thriving community of miners, your support helps drive decentralization and financial freedom for the next generation. We are shaping a resilient ecosystem where everyone can succeed. Let's mine the future together. Now, for the mining metrics. The current block time today is 872,859. The total network hash rate is 746.4 exahash. And the daily hash price is still still hovering around $60.83. So right now in this cycle, it is the best time to mine Bitcoin. We've been hitting a lull and it feels like we're coming out of it. So we'll see if uh, hash price continues to rise. Obviously, as the Bitcoin price rises, you know it, it becomes a more favorable and favorable environment for Bitcoin miners. We did hit an all time high. We hit the all-time high of 99K on November 22nd and have since been bouncing around 92K and 98K. We're currently sitting at 97,120. Our last difficulty adjustment happened on November 18th and was a 0.6% a adjustment upwards. The next adjustment in 61 blocks will happen sometime today. It's slated to be an upwards adjustment of 2%. As always, the last thing in our mining metrics is the fee environment. We're looking at seven sats per V-byte. Make sure you guys get those UTXOs in order. It's a perfect fee environment for it. Uh, if you guys are confused on how to do that, just shoot me an email and I'll help you. If you're looking to get a good price on some S19s, we have 500 used S19 XPs at 141 terahash and 200 used S19 XPs at 131 terahash. Those are coming out of Norway. We also have delivered within... We also have delivered to your door within two weeks of purchase some L7 950s and some L7 8800s. The 950s are priced at $7,800 USD and the L7 8800s are 7,500 USD. Uh, those are five unit minimum order quantity and they do have six months remaining on the Bitcoin or the Bitmain warranty. All right, enough business. Let's get into the news. In November 2024, last month, Bitcoin's price surged over $26,000, closing the month at approximately $96,400, a record-breaking monthly gain. This increase was driven by factors such as the approval of a spot Bitcoin ETF in the US, favorable political developments, and significant institutional investments. Needless to say, institutional investors are feeling a lot more confident with the orange man in the White House. As of December 1st, Bitcoin is trading near 97,441. I did say the price was 97,120, so that's that's accurate. Approaching the significant $100,000 milestone, analysts are divided on whether December will surpass November's gains. Some predict that breaking the $100,000 barrier could lead to a substantial could lead to substantial further gains, while others caution about potential market corrections due to profit taking and increased volatility. Investors are advised to monitor market trends closely, considering both the bullish momentum and the inherent volatility of the cryptocurrency market. We have a few educational opportunities for you coming up this month of December. Uh, December 6th, that's this Friday, we have a mastermind deep dive presented by EMCD with a guest appearance from Jake Chapin. You'll learn how to maximize profits, master reward models, and learn how to choose the right pool. You'll also learn how to manage and maintain your miners to help maximize your uptime and profitability. Join the Mastermind Deep Dive by going to the link at the bottom of your screen or the link in the description, and you can sign up for that and join us this Friday. We also have an upcoming Bitcoin mining bootcamp. This boot, this bootcamp offers an intensive hands-on journey into the world of Bitcoin mining. The program is designed for aspiring and experienced miners alike, providing practical skills and knowledge essential for managing and optimizing mining operations. So there's an online session that will happen December 10th through the 13th and an in-person session that will happen December 16th through the 17th in Dallas at the Dallas College Koppel Center. Go to BitcoinMiningWorld.com or click the link in the description of the show to find out more. Back to the news. In October 2020, 
2024, Bitcoin miners generated approximately $1.2 billion in revenue, marking a 25% increase from September and the highest monthly earnings since April. The surge is attributed to Bitcoin's significant price rise and increased transaction fees. Major mining farms like Marathon Digital and Riot Platforms re reported their highest Bitcoin production since the April halving event, with Marathon mining 717 bit Bitcoin and Riot producing 505 Bitcoin in October. However, the upcoming Bitcoin halving in April 2028 is expected to reduce the block rewards from 3.125 to 1.5625 Bitcoin, which will impact miner revenues even further. Analysts estimate that miners could face an annual revenue loss of up to $10 billion post halving. I would say that right now is the best time to get into Bitcoin mining. Build an efficient and effective Bitcoin coin mining operation, use our platform, use our educational opportunities to help you get into the world of Bitcoin mining. It's only getting harder and hash price is only going down and to the right. So if you're going to get into Bitcoin mining right now is the best time to do it. Not tomorrow, not next week, right now. This news broadcast is brought to you by the Pod X from Greenwich Generation, an innovative new solution for air-cooled containerized mining operations. We're self-miners ourselves. And we understand a lot of the problems that a common miner out there or a common company that runs air-cooled units might experience. And we've helped a lot of other sites that use these air-cooled solutions. And we understand what, what you go through. Like we understand the hot air research issues that might come with, uh, with some of these solutions. Like it's really what drove us to want to try and solve that into one solution, which is what we ended up doing. If you want to learn more about the Pod X by Greenwich Generation, go to podx.bitcoinminingworld.com or just click the link in the description to figure out how this containerized mining solution could help benefit your operation. And for our last story of the day, Bitcoin's recent rally towards $100,000 has sparked concerns about its accessibility to retail investors as the high price per coin can seem prohibitive. Despite the ability to buy fractional amounts of Bitcoin, many smaller investors perceive it as an asset now dominated by institutions institutional players. This shift in market dynamics has led to fewer retail investors participating in the current rally compared to the previous cycles, where their involvement significantly influenced price movements. The rise of institutional dominance in the crypto space is changing the narrative around Bitcoin, potentially alienating smaller investors. However, retail investors still have opportunities to participate through fractional ownership or alternative investment vehicles like cryptocurrency ETFs, which lo offer lower barriers of entry. Education and risk assessment remain crucial as the crypto market continues to exhibit high volatility. While the current price surge highlights Bitcoin's appeal as a store of value, it also underscores the importance of a of diver diversification and careful planning for individual investors looking to navigate the changing landscape of cryptocurrency markets. As I always say, guys, don't ever invest in something that you don't understand. It's always it's always better to read a book and watch a podcast or join our mastermind and some of Bitcoin Mining World's other educational outlets to find out how Bitcoin can be advantageous in your life. First, understand the, the fundamentals, then invest in the coin. That's all from me today. This news broadcast was brought to you by Channel 256 and Bitcoin Mining World. If you enjoyed today's broadcast, we encourage you to like and subscribe for more just like it. And remember, guys, stay humble, stay solvent, stack some sats.